turning a tragedy into a truly worthy cause. A week tonight, Meridian Hall here on Front Street will be bursting with energy, music, comedy, and love. It's a charity event with an aim to raise $1 million while celebrating the birthday of the late Anne Marie D'Amico, who should have been turning 34 this coming Friday. She put her whole heart into everything, and she really just wanted the best for others and try and bring them up as much as possible. April 23rd, 2018. It's a day many in Toronto will never forget, as a killer behind the wheel of a van drove down Young Street, terrorizing a city and stealing away lives, including Anne-Marie D'Amico's. Though out of the senseless tragedy, a family handcuffed in grief are banding together to celebrate a beautiful soul who's now looking down from above. She would say, good work. She would say, good work, keep it up. She would say, you know, keep using my name to help others. And that's exactly what the D'Amico family are doing. In 2019, the foundation in Anne Marie's name hosted an evening called the Turtle Project event. And after taking a year off due to the pandemic, it's back and set to take center stage this coming Friday. It's going to be emotional, but I think it's also going to be an extremely lively performance. The whole the whole evening just ties together from the first act to the end and it's kind of we kind of weave through different live performances that just are there to kind of celebrate with us and to help us raise awareness for our cause. So it's it's going to be a lot of positive energy. And among the live performances bringing the energy on December 3rd is Toronto pop rock duo Crash Adams. It was a no-brainer we said yes, we wanted to be there to support the cause and just to support Anne Marie. Uh, on her birthday, which we think is a, uh, it's going to be a great day and we're, we're excited to be there. She really wanted to push a positive human connection, which right now we believe is more important than ever. Um, yeah. And it really lines up with what we would like to do for the world. The goal is to raise $1 million for the North York Women's Shelter. Following the initial event in 2019, the foundation has raised more than $500,000, which helped build the Anne Marie D'Amico Community Collective. Sadly, just two weeks ago, a 65-year-old woman who was injured and remained in hospital for the last three years following the van attack died of her injuries. Knowing that another life has been lost from the horrific attack, does it reinforce the importance of the Turtle Project and the performances here on Friday? Absolutely. Absolutely. I think we gotta, we all as a community need to keep, keep striving to be better, keep loving, keep caring, keep going out there and doing more. Again, the inspiring Turtle Project event takes place this coming Friday, December 3rd here at Meridian Hall on Front Street. If you'd like to purchase tickets, you can go to the D'AmicoFoundation.org. I'm Adrian Gobriel for City News.